In this section, we are going to begin exploring contributed modules. We are going to look at Drupal's file structure, Path Auto, Color Box, and the Video Embed field. In this video, we will examine Drupal's file structure. We will look at the organization of the directories, following best practices for the modules and themes directories, and using the sites directory. Let's start out by looking at the root directory of our Drupal installation. One point to note immediately is that there is a core directory. That's where almost everything that ships with Drupal goes. There are a few files that we do see located in the root directory itself that also ship with Drupal core. We can take a look inside the core directory and see that it contains the modules and themes directories. All of Drupal 8 core modules and themes go in these directories. Just for curiosity's sake, let's look at what's inside of the modules directory and what's inside of the themes directory. Now let's head back to our root directory and recall that there is a modules subdirectory and a themes subdirectory there. We may use these directories for contributed and custom modules and themes. If we look inside the modules directory, we will see there is a readme file, which explains the very same things we are learning about right now. The sites directory also contains a readme file that explains the purpose of that directory, as well as the new best practice for organizing our modules and themes. This directory is used for single site or multi-site configuration. We are running a single site setup in this course. Let's take a look inside sites default files. We see a number of directories which are used for things like configuration, aggregation, compiled objects, and uploaded content. The sites directory is still an important part of Drupal. We can finish up our exploration of the directory structure by implementing a Drupal best practice. Create a contrib directory and a custom directory under the modules directory and create a contrib directory and a custom directory under the themes directory as well. Excellent! We are setting ourselves up for success.